welcome back everybody it's me Z and I'm back with another GTA 5 video today we're doing quad duplication uh, what you want to do man is go ahead and have the Sand King XL in here guys and the Street Blazer uh, yeah, as you can see right here I took a bunch of my uh, my vehicles out and I blew them up just to create some space if you guys got like eight Fagios in here you can go and take them out and blow them up and still do this glitch with the invisible Fagios okay so what you want to do is put the blazer in the corner and have the Sand King pressed up against it like this here. So that way you can hit uh, triangle to teleport onto the blazer. Once you do that guys, you want to just start mashing start and R2 quickly after. And uh, go to PlayStation Store to look to see if it's closed. Because uh, that's what you're looking for. Uh, as you can see, I got a couple of fails on here. I just left them on here to show you that this glitch is not easy guys. You know, timing. Uh, if you hit R2 too soon, when you hit the start menu, it's going to take you outside like that. Um, and what you want to do at that point is just drive back in and reposition the Sand King up against the blazer, which is up against the wall, okay? Because you want to block it off so you can teleport onto it by mashing triangle. Alright, remember, like I said, guys, if you want to make room here, just blow the vehicles up, fill it up with Fagios, blow them up. You can do it with invisible scooters. All right, so here we go. So we're gonna put the, um, we're gonna swap the Sand King and the Blazer. Uh, so the Sand King is pressing up against the Blazer, up against the wall, guys. Uh, make sure you have the XL. I tried it with some other vehicles, man. The struggle didn't work as well. Sand King XL is the way to go. All right, so once you have that in position, guys, make your way over there. Hold, uh, hit triangle just to teleport on there. You're gonna hit start R2, which is accelerate. Okay, start R2. All right, what you're looking for is the PlayStation Store to be closed. All right, so once you hit Start R2, scroll over to PlayStation Store, see if it's closed. All right, see, there, that's what you're looking for right there. Unavailable, once that happens, just hit Circle, Triangle, Triangle to make him get off the bike, okay? Just like that. Once he gets off the bike, now good news is, guys, you only got to do that part one time. All right, so... Once he gets off the bike, what you want to do is take a Fagio and put it on top of the scooter. I mean, the blazer, okay? Alright, the blazer is going to stay in its spot where it is. So don't worry about it. That's the way it's supposed to go. You see how it just stayed there? Alright, so once you select the Fagio, you put it on top of the blazer. It doesn't move. It stays there. Alright, so what you want to do is go back to the blazer. Hit triangle. Mash right on the D-pad to enter the mod shop. Uh, once you enter the mod shop, all you want to do is change the license plate, guys. Okay, then back out. Alright, once you back out, just uh, go ahead and hit triangle to get off. Go back over to your blue marker. And select the next Fagio. And what you want to do is take the Fagio and put it back on that same blazer. Uh, as you can see, it says that it's a blazer, but it still looks like a Fagio there. So what you want to do, just like I said, take the next Fagio, go ahead and swap it on top of that blazer. Neither one of them are going to move. Alright. As you can see, it's still a blazer. Hit triangle, right on the D-pad, enter the mod shop, change the plate. You just do this over and over, guys, uh, until you run out of Fagios. And like I say, if you want room in your garage, you can blow these Fagios up outside and still do this glitch. You don't have to have them in the garage. Uh, shouts out to Tudo for Silk France, man, for finding this glitch, dude. Uh, he's finding a lot of these glitches lately, man. Dude is sick. And uh, shouts out to him, man. Alright, so, you know, like I said, just keep repeating this process until you're out of Fagios. You know, once you put the Fagio on top of the blazer, go in the mod shop, change the plate, come back out. You know, hey guys, sorry I ain't been on the last couple of days, man. I had some family stuff, you know, with the holidays and everything, but uh, hopefully we'll get back on track, man, now that the holiday is over. And uh, so I hope you guys had a happy holiday as well, guys. All right, as you can see um, on my menu here, I'm out of Fagios. Uh, they all say Street Blazers, even though you see a couple of Fagios there. So 
So once once you don't have any fag heels on your menu, guys, what you want to do at that point is go ahead and make your way out of the garage. And I do know these things sell for about 250000 each, guys. Um, like I said, once you start the glitch, it's pretty easy just to make them over and over and over. Uh, the first part of the glitch is the trickiest. Now, see, once you come back in, guys, they've all turned into blazers now, guys. All the scooters are now blazers, and uh, you can sell these things, like I said, about 250 each, somewhere in there if they're fully modded. All right? And uh, as you can see now on the menu here, everything's a blazer. You know, hey, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. Please drop a like, guys. Let's got to get some likes on this video, man, to get it out there. More likes we get, more views we get, guys. Hey, I really appreciate you checking out the vid. As always, check back with me next time. Peace.